managed to lay his hands on the powerful scepter of Nefertiti, but Dante has put a tracking device on it in order to locate Klaus in his secret base. The hunting team follows Klaus and sneaks into a bookshop, despite the lethal traps disseminated by Klaus. Dante and the hunted team manage to recover the mythical spear of Vlad, but Zalia is in Klaus's hands. Titans locked away in Vlad Dracul's castle are dangerously close to falling straight into the professor's hands. And you were hoping <coughs> that the mission would be to find a cure <coughs> for my illness. <coughs> yes, your life is more important. Dante, your first priority must always be to fight evil. <coughs> Just remember. <laughs> Dante, are you all right? You haven't been yourself since you got back from Germany. Hmm? You seem preoccupied. Take this morning, for example. All right. Transylvania, here we come. That's only in the movies. Vlad was actually the prince of a neighboring province, Wallachia. All right, team. Mm -hmm. Everyone ready to go? Uh. What's wrong, Locke? Did I forget to pack something? Caliban, Solwing, Metagolem, Freelancer, the Holotome? Don't worry, it doesn't look like you forgot anything important, Dante. <sighs> All right, Seekers, let's get started. We have a mission. Mission, the Titans of Vlad Dracul. Reach the castle of Vlad Dracul and prevent the organization from taking Vlad's Titans. Vlad Dracul possessed an impressive collection of Titans, including the vampiric Antediluvian. Antediluvian, attack four, defense five, type Draco Titan Warrior. Special abilities, flight, the Boreal power drain. Wait, I thought this guy was a vampire like Dracula. He was actually a seeker, one of the most evil in history. Vlad's reputation was so bad, normal people figured he had to be a monster. But if these titans were bonded to such an evil man... Then they'll attract other evil seekers, right, Dante? <laughs> exactly. If the Professor ends up with Vlad's collection of titans, it would be a disaster for the Hunting Foundation. Master! Which way to the castle? Fun moment. Never lost. There. The legendary titans are hidden for my newfound power, but not Vlad's wonderful Master! Stash. It's the Professor! He demands a bird! You promised me more titans, Klaus! I must have them to realize my goals! Never fear, Professor. i found quite a treasure. Zalia? Uh... Huh? Dante, uh, what do you want? It looks like this mission has you on edge. Uh, I just have a bad feeling, that's all. Is there something you want to tell me? You're the one with something on your mind. It's that Huntic Foundation bigwig you keep visiting, right? So, you know about Metz? Of course. He's the top dog on the Huntic Council. And he's also the one who taught me to be a seeker. He was my whole world. And now, he's... Very sick. I don't know how much longer he has. Dante, I know how you feel. I have someone like that. I'm so sorry. Zalia, there's something I've been meaning to say. Yes. And that is... Wait! <laughs> Zalia, what are you doing? Touch Ram! Ah! 
No ticket. Red Pulse! How do we get in? With the Spear of Vlad. It may not have magic powers, but it does serve as a key for the castle. Ugh, that's pleasant. I'm sensing evil powers. Looks like a nasty place. Klaus will be drawn to an evil place like this. In fact, I'm sure he's already found his own way in. The castle has three sections, the main area, the tower level, and the basements. Vlad's left a magic spell on the whole place to keep his titans invoked. They could still be active and waiting. With that power, Vlad's titans will be hard to take down. We should stay clear and fight with ranged attackers like Icarus and Garion. Obviously. Icarus, attack two, defense uh. two, type chrono titan sharpshooter, uh. size average, special abilities. Flight, blinding bolts. Garion, attack one, defense three, type Yama Titan Scout. Size, small, special abilities, limited invisibility. How are we going to search such a big castle? Well, we'll have to split up. Right. I'll take the top. With my mobility, I'll be able to go between towers quickly. Zalia will take the main area. That way, there will be space to summon King Basilisk if necessary. Wait! Just hold on a minute! Dante, don't send her alone! Haven't you noticed she's been acting even weirder than usual lately? I'm standing right here, you know. I can go with her. We made a great team in Egypt. No. You need to go with Sophie and Charon for my plan to work. The basement levels could be dangerous, but you can handle it. Just stay alert and keep your eyes open for hidden rooms. Hey, Sophie, these Titans we're looking for are supposed to be evil, right? Yes, we'll have to be careful with them. But didn't Dante teach us that all Titans are neutral? We are. I mean, that's the general rule. But Titans take on aspects of their Seekers. That's right. It said that the more powerful or extreme the Seeker, the more affected their Titans will be. Remember when Dante gave you a freelancer amulet? Freelancer bonded easily to you, since you and Dante have the same strength in your hearts. Hey, Sophie, check out this tapestry. That's odd. Those captives are being led out of an alcove. That alcove isn't big enough to hold all those guys. <laughs> Look! Above you! Oh, it's antediluvian! Quick! Out the way we came in! No! Into the alcove! Follow me! <laughs> A trigger. Close one. How did you know there was a secret door there? 
in the tapestry, a whole bunch of prisoners were being led out of the alcove. They had to come from somewhere. I don't mean to alarm you, kids, but I think we found the reason for Vlad's bad reputation. Hey, orphan, where'd you get that food? What you gonna do about it, huh? You're nothing! <laughs> yeah, you can't do a thing! Make me your leader. I'll show you how to steal food. Who's gonna take orders from a weakling like you? Do you wanna eat or not? <laughs> I like your ambition, but that's not enough. To escape these streets, you need to truly love power, enough to do anything to get it. No one would follow me. I guess I'm just a nothing. Then come with me to the organization. You will infiltrate our most troublesome opponents, the Hunting mm. Foundation. There you are, my pretty double agent. Klaus, when this is all over, everyone will show me respect, right? Certainly. And once Dante Vale and Locke Lambert are out of the picture, we will have no competition for the legendary titans. That pit is huge! Not to mention full of rusty, sharp things. What was Vlad's nickname again? You mean, the Impaler? Yep. That impaled skeleton looks like a good place to start. Okay, so are you going to invoke Kipperin and fly over? I should save enough power to invoke Lindorm, the skull. Nice, good work, Jared. That rope has a spell on it. I think it's to stop any good seekers from getting inside. Then this bag must hold Vlad's stash of amulets. We actually found it. <laughs> <laughs> One. Dante sent me to give you two a hand. Thanks, but I dropped Vlad's amulet bag. We gotta go back. Okay. One of us will act as a decoy. Fine. That'll be you, Zalia. It'll have to be. That trap hones in on whichever seeker nearby holds the strongest amulets, and that's me. How do you know whose titans are the most powerful? It could target Locke or me while you're trying to distract it. Let's ditch our amulets. If we're not wearing them, then we shouldn't register on the skull trap's hit list, right? Hmm. It could work. Uh, no way! Too risky! Wait! I have an idea! Freelancer! <laughs> Cherry, you two stay here. Guard the amulets. And call if something happens. Aye, aye! Okay, Locke. We'll do it your way. This time I've got something special. I've made some modifications to strike mode. Over mode! <laughs> <laughs> are all locked away. I'm full of surprises, too! Attack! Gabriel! I know, fool. I've still got every one of my amulets. All it required was a simple sleight of hand. Actually, I was hoping we'd get to fight one-on-one, -on -one, Sophie. Salia versus Sophie? Am I dreaming? Taking! Theon! Icarus! Fight! 
fight for your lady. Kill them! So you're part of the organization! Life is about power, and the organization is about getting power. That's why we will always dominate. Life's not about getting power, Zalia. It's about how you choose to use it. Then let's put it to use. Attack! Sabriel, defense only! I won't give you the chance to try another trick! Now! Double spell! Ray Pulse! What? No! Sophie, don't hurt her! Sophie, you've missed your one chance! No, I haven't! Bolt Flash! Sorry, little girl, but that was an illusion created by my thought spectre power! No titans! Mind sight! I can see your every move. Shut up! Now I'll put you out of my misery. Zalia! No! Let him hit! Don't do this! place I haven't checked yet is... Whoa! Did you get ugly? You're like a little lab mouse in my veins. Klaus, your experiment is about to yield some unexpected results. Caliban! Specimen, that is, for my lab. So, now what? Are you gonna finish me off? Now, she is. Ugh. You took care of the kids, did you not? Good. Now give Dante everything you've got. Zalia, what have you done? Zalia, what have you done, you fool? I told you to take care of the urchins. But they're just street kids. They are witnesses. Erase their memories. Or I'll erase them! Understood? They're no different than me. <sighs> Zalia. I know that at the end of the day, I can trust you. Zalia, I know you're a good person, no matter how you act. No! Ray Pulse! Frost! Now's my chance! Ever fight! This can't be happening! Go ahead! I've made my choice, Dante. But Klaus was like a father to me. I can't fight him. I understand. I'll get him. You clean up the rest. Ugh. I still have the advantage. You have nothing! Not even the ground underneath your feet! Medical!
with me, the victory. Farewell. Ray I guess I can't avoid fighting you after all, Klaus. You wouldn't hurt me, Zarya. You know, I think of you as my daughter. As long as I live with lies, I'll be nothing. No matter how much power I have. I'm sorry. King Baphomet! I'm just glad that Zarya didn't hurt you two. I'll finish you two off later. She said she couldn't bring herself to hurt us after witnessing my major stupidity. Jumping between us was bravery, not stupidity. Don't forget, Locke. It played a part in bringing Zarya back to her senses. It's weird. Now that I know everything Zarya went through, I kind of want to forgive her. Aye, her life was a hard one at that. But in the end, she came through for us. I won't forget that. Thank you. It means a lot. I've come to say goodbye. You know, you don't have to do that. You heard everyone. We forgive you. But I can't forgive myself. It's all right. We understand. See you. Whatever she says, Zalia's still a part of our team. She'll be back. I know it.